let's film an agronomy farm, and we do call it our living laboratory because what you see here really translates to the research products that we transition to the public. Here's what I've been looking for. The Agricultural and Food Systems Program, otherwise known as AFS, is designed to expose students to a breadth of disciplines that encompass ag and food production. The Agricultural Management, Business, and Technology major is in AFS, as is Agricultural Communications, Agriculture Education, and Organic Ag major. The AFS program is designed to equip students with a skill set that will allow them to be change agents in agriculture. So the skills that these students acquire involve critical thinking, problem solving, communication, and actually developing action plans to address those issues in an effective, efficient manner. Students with an AFS degree could work in the largest wheat field or a small organic farm or even an orchard in the middle of the state. I enjoy it when people come up to me and say, man, that Honeycrisp is the best apple I ever had. Do you grow them? And I go, yeah, and then you get to tell the story. I produce an eating experience. I'm Travis Allen, and I'm the general manager of all the orchards for Allen Brothers out of uh, Natchez, Washington. And so my job is how do we get from pruning to harvest and get the correct right size of fruit, uh, the quantity that we want per tree, and then how to get it in the bin. And so I, I'm, my job is to manage that whole system all the way through. Jazz is more of a sweet but uh, tart taste. Uh, Pacific Rose is a dessert apple, even sweeter than Fuji. These two apples have been some of the largest plantings we've done the last three years. So we're moving more and more into this niche uh, specialty market. To be organized, you have to use databases. Our time limits to make a decision and to make it correctly at the right time is so narrow because once we make it, we're basically on to the next cycle of growing each little system that I, I might develop inside the orchard, like a, a pruning system that might, might cost me 15 cents per tree, then I'm gonna analyze it, okay, what was my benefit coming out of that? Especially statistical information has really helped me springboard our company. If you like in these two, if you have both of them together, there's gonna be too much competition. And then you only want so many anyways. The great thing about Ag Food Systems program at WSU is it's giving you a slice of all the important things. You're getting the science base, they'll also have the financial base and the management, and then they will also get the great horticulture experience that WSU has already proven that they're good. And the new programs that they're bringing on with the quality professors that they have there, WSU is looked at as one of the core knowledge bases in the world. And so you might go to Harvard to get your business education, but you're going to go to WSU to get a great horticulture education. What WSU gives you is the foundation. It gives you the networks. It gives you the brain power. So when you leave, how to do research, how to think through problems, instead of someone giving it to you, you've got to dig. And especially in agriculture, everybody has unique situations. I love working with people, and this is a people job. You have to work with the scientists all the way from WSU and the extension agents and people around the world to get ideas that I could implement on my farm. Well, this is looking pretty good, huh? Yeah, it's looking better now. I think so. I mean, it's exactly what we talked about. For people with Ag Food Systems degree, that they could communicate with anybody on any level, uh, if it's the science field or if it's the financial field or in the orchard, they're, they're going to be ready to go and be able to build their base and their knowledge. Because when you're coming out of college, you know a lot, but you just what you have now is skills to learn more. That's the way I look at it. Go Cougs!